Oh my God, this is so weird. That floor is exactly the same. Really? Mm. Wow. And that newel post is exactly the same. Those um, banisters. Oh, God, it's so weird. Do you get a Where... feeling walking up the stairs though of being little or? Yeah, kind of. It, it's you so strange because the shapes are all the same, but like, so that was our, that was the toilet. Is that still the toilet? Have a look. Yes, it is. It is. So this was the kind of dining room. God, it looks so small. It is small. Yeah. We didn't eat here like every, every day. day. So this was kind of a... A special room. A special room, in. yeah. Just this notion that every room had a little purpose as well. Yeah. And then this was our living room. Oh, wow. It just does seem so small. Does it really? Mm. I think it looks enormous. From what I can remember. Mm. And it, it had... We, missed, but we had a piano there, I think. Do you know, I was kind of thinking I was going to feel really strange coming back here. And I do feel strange, but it's a nice strange. It's a nice it, feeling? Yeah, it does feel like kind of coming home. Hmm. Mm. Now I've just realised that we had bed because this was a bedroom. We had bed. We had bedrooms with no windows. Oh my god! Although no, hang on. I'm telling a lie. There was a, there was a, there was a. What do you call it? A uh, skylight. Skylight. Why would you get rid of Why the skylight? Why would you get rid of the skylight? Do we have to do all the work? Oh. Four siblings. Yes. Mark, Julian, you, and Maria. Were you a gang of four? Were there factions? There were factions. Over the years, we've sort of, like, Maria and I have been, again, you know, like the boys, I suppose, like, best of friends mm. or really at each other's throats. But then, yeah, and we've all got very different relationships with each other. And when you, when you came out here as a little kid, you know, all kids have their boundaries. Mm. Where you're allowed to go, you can't only up to that street. What were your boundaries? Because the well, sea's you right know, there. it depends on what age and stuff, but I could always go to my godmother's up there or my godmother up there. And um, as I, when I was about five, I was allowed to go to the local shop, which was down that lane, cross over road, down another little lane, and there it was. And that was my first sense of independence. And I had 5p pocket money, and I could go and buy a Shiver and Shake comic and a 1p bubble gum. <gasps> what more do you need in life? Nothing.